Hey guys, it's Anne over at Plan Obsessed, and today we're going to take a look in on my Red Wiggler and European Nightcrawler, formerly Cocoon Only bins. I've been trying to let them dry out, but it is really not drying. I've had the lid off for at least a good two weeks. I suppose it's better. It is. It is better. The the worms are still not really moving out here. But I am just going to keep leaving this portion undone, and hopefully they will move out. Take a quick look over here at the feeding zone and see what we're accomplishing. It does look like I have quite a bit of worms in this area. No, 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 you get back over here. I don't really see any food left. I'm just seeing worms. So I'm going to keep keep adding food to this side. Looks like I've got a little corn cob still. Okay, I'm going to switch hands and we'll go over here and see what these guys are doing. This one seems to be drying out a little bit more. I see a cocoon right there. So I, th I don't know, this one seems like it's making more progress. So let's see what the food's doing over here. And it looks like they still have uh, apple core in here, so they've still got some food. But the idea of the feeding zone is to entice them to move over more. So we'll give them some more food. All right, I'll be right back with the food. Today what they're going to get is some bread that didn't quite make it. Seems like there's quite a bit of that lately. I'm in the busy time of work, and so we buy groceries, and honestly, they just don't get used. So I'm going to give them some sloppy wheat bread and cover that up, and then just to kind of make the feeding zone a little bit more hospitable, I'm going to put some bubble wrap on this end. And then this portion here perhaps will dry out a little bit better and maybe they will leave. Okay, so then same thing over here. Got a couple gnats happening. I'm pull this stuff back and give them some bread. Alright, cover that back up. Get all the stuff that was over there and give them give them some bubble wrap too. Alright, well, not super exciting. But horizontal migration is a slow job, and they are certainly taking their time with it. All right, guys. Well, if you like the video, give me a muddy thumbs up. And if you're not a member of my worm family, click that subscribe button. And if you want to know what I'm doing and when I'm doing it, ring that little bell icon. All right, guys. Thanks for hanging out with me and my worms, and everybody, have a good day.